Good afternoon, boy, ch kids, and welcome to Crafty Friday once again, where we have a very interesting craft for you today. It's called a twirly toy. It won't make any sense to you until, this was my sample. <laughs> it was right there, but not, not anymore. But it's a twirly, twirly to toy, and you will see how it works at the very end. But the first thing we will do is, these are the pieces that we'll need. We don't need the scissors because all the strips have been cut out for you. We won't need, well, if you have a glue gun, you can use it. But if you don't, Elmer's glue will do. It'll just take longer to dry. We do have set a, one of these for you. This will be the stick that everything goes on at the end. And you have some of these strips. I did make one that was colorful like this, and then I had to make it again. <laughs> uh, you will need to have a stick of, a stick, glue stick. It also comes with four of these. And this is what, is what holds everything together. So let's get started on our twirly toy. The first thing we'll do is, we'll set this down. Well, I, I guess I should explain everything. You will take your you will take your strips, and then you will apply it to one strip at a time to the one of the circles. They can overlap; they don't have to. You can do it that way, and then you do it this way, and then. Whatever color you want, whatever combination of colors you want, you put them all on one side, it's up to you. And I put another one right here. And of course, what I need to do now is actually glue them down. I should have put the glue on them before I put them down, but I wanted to show you what to do with it first. So this is going to go here. The further back you put it, the longer the strips will be for your twirly toy. Just a little bit of glue from the glue stick. If you use Elmer's glue for this, it's about drying time. And when Fridays look like this, or maybe the weekend looks like this, you don't wanna spend a whole bunch of time waiting for it to dry. And apply until you have them all attached okay so i don't need that and that goes there put this one here just as fast as i can and how about a blue one on this side i'm not going in any order putting these on not at all okay Put these to the side. Attach. Put another blue one over here. And attach. They will overlap to a certain degree, so don't worry about that. And that that is quite fine. This one, press, and now guess what happens now? <laughs> Eventually we're gonna have two colors that are the same, maybe right next to each other, but that's okay. No complaints there. And press until they are all gone. The more you put on, the better it will look. choice here. Put that one there. And press. It's starting to stick to my fingers <laughs> because putting glue on them. Put this one here. And press. 
This is again a, a special toy made from the site of Pinterest. You can you can type in twirly toy and you will find out there are many designs, many, many, many designs. Now, <laughs> sticky. Now, what happens next? Well, you can put this on that, but it must line up with the, uh, the hole that's already made. For, well, you have to make your holes where they are going to line up. You'll find out, you'll find out why that's important when we, when we finished. So again, we need to put glue on here. This is the one without glue. Get enough glue on there. And then we, we are going to press this on. Looking for my hole so it's lined up. I guess if it had been right in the middle, it wouldn't be a problem. But sometimes it's a little bit off-centered when you make holes and what you make them with. Okay. Wrong side. My hands are so sticky. <laughs> Very sticky now. And that may happen to you too, but that's, you know what, that's okay. Okay, so we put it back on the table flat. And what do we do now? Well, guess what? We need to put this on the stick. Now, my holes were not made to fit the stick, but as I push it through, it will enlarge. Okay, it will enlarge. And we need to attach these strips here to this. And that's what this is. That's what this is right here. You put those on. That one has, this, this diagram here actually has one of these circles on the bottom. And this circle here will go on top of this one. Now I do have a sample. Again, I will sh you, you'll see it as soon as we finish. I'll have to get up and go get it. I'm not sure why I moved it, but I did. But, okay, so I'm gonna push this back a little bit. And then we will start attaching. This will go on the underside. This will go on the underside. The more space there is between, the more space there is between this, the circle with the, 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 the orange circle, the longer your strips will be and the more you big to see the detailing and just what has to happen, okay? So this is gonna go on that side, and then I'm going to place it. You'll find out why I have to do it like this, because once that stick is on, once the stick is on there, and then you press it, make sure it stays. Make sure you press it tight so it stays. And then you get the next one and you put glue on the top side of it, in the middle. On these, it doesn't go on this side, it goes on this side, the bottom portion. And it goes on the bottom. I guess I could have done that another way, but I could have done it the same way I did the first one. Sometimes you want to try something different. I don't think I have enough glue on this one. May have to put some more. Because when you start twirling your, your toy, if the glue hasn't been placed on there enough, it's going to fly away. Okay, you must put enough glue on these strips. That glue goes on this side. And each one, it seems tedious, but when you find out what it does, it's, it'll be fun. Right. Place, and then press, 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 press. 
that's the top. So if this one needs to go on, this one needs to go on too, because this will be the one that's on the bottom. So you need to put that on there too. And you can make a hole, you can ask your parents to help you make a hole so that the stick will fit through it. Don't make it too big or it's not going to work right, okay? Okay. Next. And yes, you will find out that this is a very sticky situation here. And you know what? Glue washes off nicely. A little soap and water and the glue will be gone. So don't worry about getting it on your fingers. Don't rub it on your clothes. Please don't do that. <laughs> I have seen that for years happen in daycares. And I'm like, don't do that, don't do that. And before I could say don't, it's on there. But again, it washes out. Okay. Is it starting to look like something? Not quite. Keep going. Have you seen the one that was made already? Cody? I have not. <laughs> I'm sorry. I might have been in, I may have to have had to go into tech service to find it. <laughs> and, uh oh, not enough glue. Turn it around a little bit. Make sure I have enough glue. Press it on. We need to get it in all those little corners too, okay? There. Place it on. Pressing, 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 pressing. It's attached. See how they all look? They look just like this one, but it's the other way. Okay, the next one will be green again. And on this side. run a little bit so I can get this attached and again sometimes it has to overlap onto another color because there's just not enough room for them all see how they're overlapping that's quite all right they are touching yes and it's okay I use this glue on my finger to go right here. These, um, this craft is actually in the lobby right now. You can pick it up at any time. You don't have to come inside the building and get yours and take yours home. The two set colors. This is the green, yellow, and blue. The other ones are in a pinkish tone. The other ones are in a pink tone. Okay, press it down. Make sure it stays. Side. More glue. I think the more you, you do this, the more glue you get on your hands, <laughs> which is not a problem. I would let you let me wash my hands, but you know what washing hands is, right? Of course you do. I want you boys and girls and kids to know that we are preparing for our crafts for summer reading. A lot of our activities will be happening outside and we'll have it the same way we had last year. We'll have packets, the snagger bags, where you would come in, get your, get your bag. Registration starts on June 1st. Getting there, getting there. You see how it's actually bowing now? It's actually taking a sh taking shape. And getting enough glue. I don't know if I waited for a while to do. <laughs> Wrong side. 
No, it's the right side, right there. It's on there. I don't know how long I waited before I actually played with the one I have because the glue does have to set up because you don't want your pieces to fly off as you're touring it, okay? Three more to go. Should have used this as a brace. And it won't fall. Okay. That glue on there. I'm just gonna get the glue on my thing. That's it. Put it in there. And these are really, really gonna overlap. I probably should have overlapped a little bit more, but sometimes you don't know what you, what's gonna happen until it happens. There. Pressing, pressing, pressing. Two more. And you know what? They are going to fit. <laughs> there you go. Go in, it'll be easier for you to go in than me because your hands are smaller, but you have to go in the circle of strips and make sure you, you press it so it stays. And you, it seems like you need like two pairs of hands. It's on there, and I'm going to press to hold it in place for a few seconds. And there. One more strip. Last, last strip. And the tricky part is going to be coming up soon. Because if we would just have this toy as it is, bad things would happen. I mean, really bad things. Okay. Pressing, pressing, pressing. And there. I'm going to... Should I put... I'm going to let this come out from my circle. I didn't want to put glue on it too soon because the glue will dry and nothing would stick. So I'm putting glue on the side that is outside of the stick. I'm not sure if that makes any sense. I'm putting glue so that these two pieces meet. These two pieces, well, th it needs to meet here on the bottom. And that's what's gonna help hold it together. That may be enough glue now. And I'm going to work my fingers around, pressing, 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 pressing. Now, here's the hard, the next hard part. We have to get this through that other hole. There, it's through. I'm making it a little wider by pushing it through. Does that look like anything to you? Well, you're gonna be so surprised when you see how this works. Now, if we don't have a topper for this, we, there's no topper, but you know what the topper is? It's going to be when you take your Elmer's glue, if you have a glue gun, that's fine. If you don't, that's fine too. You can use a liquid glue like and make it get up come out of there <laughs> have you ever had a fight with a glue bottle i have many times and that looks like it might be something that's hardened across that tip there. and okay there's a clog in there somewhere Oh, oh, there it is, there it is. Okay. So, you do want to bring that up as high as you can. Now, this one is not going to work right. You know why? 
because the glue is not dry. It is very, very wet. So this could take overnight to dry. It could take over the weekend to dry, but you may need to put on several layers of glue, several. If you would page the floor, I will go get the original. Okay. Now, and see the glue is running because it's still wet. And I should have had some pencil, pencil box to stick this in, but that's gonna take several days to, to set up and dry. But this is the one I made as a sample. <laughs> and it's all right at the bottom. So the top is the one that has to stay without moving. It has to stay stable. You don't want this top piece to move at all. But how do you like that? It has all of these geometric shapes. This one has been played with for a while. And it's called a twirly toy, twirly toy. And yours is in the lobby waiting for you. We made a, a lot extra this time for, for Crafty Friday. So I hope you will enjoy making this as much as I am, because this is nice. I know, I know. It'll, it'll be nice for a while and then we'll have some other crafty toy to play with, but. This is a toy toy and it came from the Pinterest website that has marvelous, marvelous crafts. Okay, well, enjoy, please. <laughs> yeah, this, if I kept doing that, like I did this one, all of this would come off. So don't do that when it's, well, that's still wet. Okay, you will listen to me because I know what I'm talking about. Thank you and please have a great afternoon.